New at 11 in Central Florida, family is searching for answers after their horse is found dead in a pasture. They believe that somebody mutilated the animal because of the grotesque way that they found it. New 6's Clay Lapart is in Marion County where the family is pushing to find the culprit. Tammy Davis and her mother Rosalie were supposed to spend the day preparing their Thanksgiving meal. That's where it happened. Instead, the two are now trying to figure out what happened after they woke up to a call learning one of Tammy's horses was found dead at this farm along Southwest 16th Avenue where he was being boarded. I got him at a time when I was told I would no longer be able to have kids. So I got my kid as a horse. He is my son. He is my life. Here's a picture of what the 21 year old horse Hot Rod used to look like. We can't air on television what he looks like now, but both describe how Hot Log's leg was broken and his hide taken off. Someone's just gone in and gutted him from his neck down, taken all his meat, his fur, his skin on both sides, left his hindquarters and left his head. Hot Rod wasn't the only horse in this pasture. The Davis family had another one. Copper. She's okay. Nothing happened to her, which makes the Davis family wonder. Tammy Davis tells News 6 she's reached out to the sheriff's office and other agencies because she and her mother believe it wasn't an animal that did this. Where an animal uses teeth, this was not teeth. Not teeth at all. It was a very clean cut and they stripped both sides of the body. Now the two are hoping investigators will be able to figure out what happened. We need to find out who is doing this so nobody else's horses can have the same problem. In Marion County, Clay Lepard getting results News 6. We're told the Marion County Sheriff's Office is aware of the incident. We're waiting to hear back if detectives have started an investigation.